training peaks. How does that help you with your performance? Yeah, it's just nice and easy. So right when I click, uh, when I'm done my ride, I click save on the Brighton and then automatically it sends the data to my Training Peaks account and then I can log on and I can see all the statistics from the race that might be useful for the training and just to see how hard the race was, so. Because yesterday was quite a hard race, right? Yeah, yesterday was definitely a, a tough race for sure, so yeah. And what? how can you see that on the Training Peaks application that you've been suffering yesterday? Uh, they have all sorts of good calculations with, uh, they have TSS and they have basically uh, just a good measure of how hard the day was in general, but it also breaks down to the different zones and your different peak powers that you did and the different uh, peak heart rates that you did and everything like that. So it's quite useful to kind of be able to pick apart the, the race as a whole and see everything. So. We'll see, I think it's a hard start today, but uh, Hopefully keep it all together and then go for uh, Rudy in the sprint today. So, cause it's a good, uh, it's a fast finish for sure. A tough start, but a fast, fin fast finish today. What's your favorite Belgium rider from the Israel Startup Nation team? Alex, this morning we were talking about the training peaks. How about today? Do you think the score is higher than yesterday? Uh, it depends. I think if you look at the last 30, 40k, there is for sure because. Uh, we had a strong breakaway out there today, but we wanted to bring it in for Rudy. We ended up the last 40k, we really had to go full out to bring back the breakaway, so it was definitely a hard day out there. 